Hello everybody, and today we are going to review, oh boy, the Hasbro Power Ranger Lightning Collection Omega Ranger. That, that by the way, this guy is an Amazon exclusive, so you guys should, so, so he could, so yeah, he's on Amazon for 30 bucks. I got this guy somewhere on the, I got the guy somewhere last year on Black Friday on within my online shopping. And I was really hyped for the figure, to be honest with you. But we're gonna talk about we're gonna talk about blah, blah, blah. We're gonna talk about blah, 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 blah. today we're gonna talk about the good and the bad of this figure. So yeah, let's do it. Okay, first up, color scheme. First up, the colors are I like like the freaking uh, colors because it's accurate to show source material to that in the Sentai version in the American version. Now the bad, but for 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 before we talk about the bad, let's talk about the good. The helmet I like, but I feel like it's a little bit too big because I know the show I know in the show it was somewhat smaller because his. Here's the freaking S. Here's Sky's helmet. Here's a Mega. Sky's helmet is a little bit more smaller, and a Mega is a little bit more bigger. But his was somewhat smaller in the show. Let's talk about. Let's talk about this. The Morpher, yes, the Morpher is not painted, which is disappointing. And same in the back, Hasbro. I don't know what Hasbro been doing. They might have been smoking something. Or doing something because they totally forgot to do this. So let's, so let's look at articulation. Articulation is pretty good. Not gonna lie. Hmm. Sorry, sorry. Yeah, articulation is pretty good for the guy, but I still have problem with. I still have problem with some problem. Um, sorry for starting. I do have some problem with his articulation. I just don't like how the figure feels. You know. Let's see. Okay, let's. Uh, uh, okay, talk about. Uh, no, I'm just kidding. Here are his accessories. We have we have his lightning hand effect, which is basically we, which is a basically a repaint of the Psycho Ranger effect, but just paint the go of paint in white. And we have another open palm hand, so you could do like his electro mode or something. We have an unpainted SPD badge. Sorry you can't see it because it's freaking white, but you have an unpainted SPD badge. And I have no idea what the heck these two are for. So, so what? Are, what do you think of him? Well, before we do, before we go on side comparison, we're going to talk about this. This is an Omega bike, and honestly, to be honest with you, I do not like this thing. I'm sorry, I did not like the Omega Range, the, the, the Omega bike. When, when I first got this, these two pieces, one of the two pieces fall off many times, and I had to somewhat jam, jam it up in there, which I did. But, I did not like this Omega bike, and there's no point of it to be, there's no point of it to be added into this figure. But, you can't use you can use that for like any like pictures or stop motion or whatever you want to do with it. I'm not gonna stop it there. So now we're gonna go on to size comparison. Let's put him next to a fellow SPD, next to another fellow SPD Ranger. But I, I will do a review of the two pack. Let's put him next to a Vegeta with the Demonica Fit Head. And next to Pickle Man.
Oh well, I think he scaled pretty well with Sky. What? Why he look more taller than Sky? He he wasn't tall in the show. He, okay, that gotta be me. But he looks somewhat a little bit more taller than Sky because while I'm looking at right now, since I have my camera down here, my phone, I'm looking up here. He looks so, but he looks somewhat more taller than Sky. I don't know, but but he scaled pretty well. Not gonna lie. Get out somewhat pretty well. My friend gonna ask me, do not worry, I will do a video on this guy one really soon. So we're gonna get him next to some common riders. Here is my next to renewal of decade. Here he is right next to cross. Yeah, next to all just talking about for him. No, oh, sorry, hold on. Still pretty well with them, even though lightning collection figures are somewhat tad bit taller than a, than figure arts. But besides that, yeah, he still pretty well with them. I'm gonna put these two in the back because why not? So. Final thoughts. What do I think about this guy? <sighs> Besides a re review, I'm going to be 100% honest. Besides the pain apps, besides the pain apps, I mean, there are a lot of missing pain apps. Besides that, his articulation, oh, his articulation is good. Not perfect, but it's good. The helmet is too big. Okay, it should be somewhat smaller. It should be somewhat smaller in the show. I'm not a big fan of the bike, and I feel like I feel like I feel like he could, he still come with more hand accessories, like a fist or so. Overall, this guy is decent. He's not good. He's not perfect, but he's decent. If, if you like SPD or Toku Sentai, Tosu Sentai, uh, Tosu Sentai, uh, if you like Deck Ranger, just like me, I highly recommend you, I highly recommend you get him because since Tomashi never made a Decker Blake, this guy can be part of your Deck Ranger collection. Yeah, that's all I want to say. <laughs> Thanks for watching. Please like, comment, subscribe. My next video will probably be on two pack or old, not old, on two pack or a piccolo or cross over here. Please like, comment, subscribe, post the notification bell on for my next video. Follow my Instagram at Brokusatsu and follow my Vimeo account. I do I do cool awesome stuff on there. So yeah, my name's Aaron and I'm out. Peace.